Ladies and gentlemen, we are hunting down an evil mercenary on the planet of Podius. First, we have to get there, though. Is there a button where we can summon our spaceship? Go directly to our ship. Fast travel to ship. Yes. I think we found all the locations on the planet. What I didn't find on the planet yet is two pieces of fauna that have been missing, but whatever. Take off. It's time to leave this place. And then we will travel to a different star system. After a couple of hours, we finally leave this rock behind. <laughs> Alright. We're in space. Let's see, where are we even going? This way? How, do, how can we even travel there? Map? Um, back to system. Oh, there's our target. Okay. Is this Podius? This planet right here? Okay. Um, set course for Podius. Oh, we can also find palla palladium in that mine there. Perfect. Okay. Fast travel is currently unavailable. So what? Set landing target? Yes. Then how do you? How do we get there? And we're in system, so maybe I just go full speed. And warm the grav drive or something. I don't know. Let's see. Like, how do we... How do I get there? I don't think that flying there by hand is the, is the way to go. Set course. Unavailable. Why? Do I need to go to the other planet first? Nope, also not available. Why not? Can I not go there because I need to do my, my main quest first? I can't go anywhere else. Apparently we have I think we have to do our main quest first. Before they let us go. Graf jump to Dem Jemison. That's probably it, right? Okay, how do we graph jump? Hello? How do we jump? Hmm? Where are we even going? Alpha Centauri. Graph jumped to Jemison. Click that. Alpha Centauri. Fuel consumption is going to be hardcore. Jump. Okay, that's how we jump. We press buttons. Dot speed! Entering patrolled area. No contraband. Starship Wait for scan. This is United Colony security. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. Scan complete. No contraband detected. You are cleared for landing at New Atlantis. Okay. Thank you very much. New Atlantis. Hang on, we can scan first. Water, chlorine, lead, argon, and chlorosilanes. Alright. Plus three planetary traits. <laughs> Alright. Set landing target. And land.
Okay. The game is forcing me to come here, basically. <laughs> no more exploration until I can do something else right now. But at least we did the first planet almost completely. Alright. I'm gonna grab some stuff here because we will... Also, I can probably remove the helmet, right? Should I, should I remove the helmet? Is it weird if I run around with my helmet on 24-7? Or oh, I have all the helmets that I wanted to sell? Never mind. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, okay. Can we go directly to our ship inventory here? Cargo hold, yes. But I can't sell directly from my cargo hold, right? So I don't even have to carry all this stuff with me. But if I don't have to carry all this stuff with me, I can just store it. Right? Hide spacesuit in settlements. Okay. Uh, how do I store this thing though? There we go. Okay, now we have a lot less wor uh, stuff on us. That's good. Uh, okay. All right. Off to New Atlantis. Hey, though. Nice hum, bro. Hey, Bosco. What? No bear? Let me guess. Protocol Indigo again? Your memory is. Talk to ship services technician. What? Okay. McKinney. And here's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the trade authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. Oh. The Trade Authority runs a vending kiosk next to my booth. It's just off to the side, near the ramp. Besides that, Jemison Mercantile is your closest shop if you're looking for a bit of everything. That's further in, past the security checkpoint. Let me see I'm you sure you can find something you like. Oh, we can buy stuff here, we can buy ships here. Nice. Okay. Um, how does this work? The Rambler. The Galileo! The Achilles. The Econo Hall. <laughs> these, these are the brands, right? Okay. All oh, class A. The Kefir. And the Shield Break. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, this guy has lots of laser power. How much are these ships? Does it say. Yeah. How much are these total ships? It doesn't say. Is this just 900 credits? That's just for the graph drive. So how much is it for the whole ship? Is this like what? This is insanely unintuitive. These are, just, these are just components. Alright. 
Okay, no problem. Modify ships? How about that? Ship builder. Design, modify, and paint your ship. The flow gauge on the right tells you when new models will appear. The flow gauge is at zero, and the modules will be placed in the center mass of the ship, okay? Cost credits, leading will give you credits back. Running total for transaction at the end. Okay. Um. Ah! Cockpit. Cargo 240. Options. Edit. Go. Oh. Whee! How can I exchange that? Attach? Attach a Mauler Cannon or Disruptors or Neutron Beams and attach more weapons to it. I, I, I. What, is, what are these? Ah, these are my pulse lasers, okay. Um. But how. Can I attach a different cockpit? Or is it just to modify? What if I put this right here and then just go. Add. Structural. Weapons, base, a landing bay, no, cargo, ballast hold. Oh, okay. Now we're talking. How could I attach this? Flip. Hmm. Not here. It's gonna get expensive quickly, right? Yeah, okay, never mind. We'll, we'll fool around with that at some other day. But I want I want to add cargo holds and crew and whatnot. But Everything looks good here. I'll yeah, it's be okay. my booth if you need me. You'll be in your booth? Is that your booth? Ship services? That's probably that's that's the trade authority kiosk. Okay. So, let's see. Cell phone ship inventory. Yes! Goodbye. Tschüsschen. Auf Wiedersehen. Goodbye. 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 Yes. Ah. What? Oh, they're out of money. Why are you always out of money? What kind of vendors are you? All right, we'll have to find the other vendor, deeper in, and buy from them then. And yes, I will build a star destroyer if I can. This unprovoked attack on a United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. We'll get you settled into your new assignments as soon as possible. For you, Bobby, that includes meeting your new foster parent. My parents aren't dead. They just took a different shuttle. I'll see them when they get here. Oh, uh, well. Of course, that's sure possible. No entry for passengers without valid visa. What is this? Security checkpoint. You will be scanned. Whee! Hello. <clears throat> no mind if I do. Um. <laughs> Did I just walk into the security checkpoint? <laughs> Be like, yo! Um, can I literally steal stuff from security? Is, is this what's gonna happen here? Sergeant oh. Yumi's looking for reliable people to help the guard. Contact him if you're interested. We'd all appreciate it. Oh yeah, I'm just gonna walk straight into the security that checkpoint. Ship that landed not too long ago. It sure is. Yeah, yeah, don't worry about it. I am definitely a trustworthy person. Authorized personnel only. Yeah, well, I'm authorized, right? Okay, where are we even going here? Um, go to the lodge. All right. Okay. No bounty. You're clear. Enjoy your visit. Do you want to try to collect on that bounty? No funny stuff with that boost pack. Got enough flight traffic as it is. Join now. New Atlantis office is needed. As opens. I do my part. I'm really in the middle of something. No soliciting. Do I need to call security? Sure. Ah, that's Sergeant Yumi. 
Well, hello. You hear about the job by any chance? Uh, the officer over there can help you with any bounty issues. Tell me about the job. Part-time security officer. The position's very flexible. Uh, you can basically work whenever you're available. No pressure. We've had some gaps in the schedule lately. Macy's out on maternity leave. Jose's on loan to Sidonia. When it rains, it pours type of situation. So really, we just need someone to fill the void. I'm an expert at filling Interested? voids. Well, uh, first things first, I have to ask, do you have any security experience at all? I killed 30 pirates before coming here. And around with the Crimson Fleet. It sure counts for something. I mean, you're alive. And you're resilience alive! is definitely an important trait the box for alive. any officer. Well, I think I've heard all I need. Your first assignment couldn't be easier. Go to Mast and check in with Agent Plato at Aegis. There was a package left at a dead drop and they need UC security to handle it. He'll fill you in on the details. Ah, we got some money. Nice. What's Mast? You know, Mast. Uh, the Military, Administrative and Scientific Triumvirate. Ah. Giant building in the center of the city. Ah, the mast. I Headquarters see. of the entire United Colonies. <laughs> I really should have given you a more thorough interview. <laughs> okay, that was good dialogue. Aegis, they're basically UC intelligence. They help identify threats to New Atlantis before they become problems. While we're separate departments, there are times we need to rely on each other, so it's important to keep a good working relationship. We do Agent Plato this favor, and maybe he'll toss us some intel when an investigation stalled. Tit for tat. You know how it works. Okay. Why am I bringing the package here? Well, just because you're bringing it here doesn't mean that's where it'll end up. As for why, you can ask Aegis. As far as I'm concerned, it's no. None of our business? Okay. Let me know if you have any questions. Alright, not a problem. My question is, of course, as always, A. Making sure we have enough hard drive space left to keep recording. B. Where's the loot? Hello? I'm really rather busy. If you'll Don't wanna talk me. to me? Okay. So I joined up, right? So I am I'm basically basically an employee, right? Hey, how's it going? Oh, hello. Cells. With shitters. Oh, hello. I have nothing to say. I desire no company. Leave. Who are you? I am a prisoner. Trapped by a weak people who do not kill their enemies when they should. The Great Serpent called me to fight the unbelievers in the United Colonies. But I was ambushed, and my ship disabled. Now, I am here. He's a cultist. We are no longer alone. She is also invulnerable. Because these guys are not invulnerable. Hello. Why are you guys such wimps? Oh, essential NPC. Alright, well, I just wanted to see what happens. Um, you cannot kill essential NPCs. Good to know. So. That girl, essentially NPC. You know I went to chef school? This ain't exactly where I saw myself. Ah, yes, chef school. Oh, hello. Are there maybe weapons or ammo here? Oops. Let's see. Stel settler comfort wear. No, we don't need that. Needle packs. I don't want that stuff. 
streetwear, utility knives, vice grip. Hmm. People have weird things in there. Why is there a toilet paper tube in there? Why would you have that in your... what? Why would you have that in your locker? Also, where's my locker? I just joined. I just joined up. You see security key card. Oh. Ah! <laughs> I have got a security key card now. Not sure what I'm gonna do with it, but I have it. What? There's nothing here. Okay. Um, that's it. That's a security key card. Let's get out again. Flying crow busting. Lol, why is that in his locker, he says, while hoarding 800 kilograms of loot? You are correct, good sir. You are 100% correct. I am the loot lord. You know what? I gotta hand it to them, though. I mean, this is a handcrafted space, right? But just look at this. Just look at the scope of it. Sit back and take it in for a sec. This looks cool. They got this like interesting architecture where it's like integrated into the cliffs with that sculpture in front of it. A little, little bit of like lake. What happens if I go in there? Oh, okay, I'm a stone, I can I think. Ah yes, the the public fountain. Yes, let me just uh, la -di -da, wash myself a little bit. All right, I'm clean now. The viewport, whatever that is. Jemison Mercantile, yes. Barrett enjoys this establishment. He frequently buys paper, recycle, and trash. This is like Germany ever since 2000. <laughs> Overweight. Huh? Crystal meth. Oh no, crystal water. Sorry, I just read I just read crystal. It's crystal water, it's not crystal meth. Okay. <laughs> oh. oh, that looks nice. Yep, yep, yep. Hope you're finding everything you need. Well, what's this, by the way? The storeroom. I can just go to the back door without being thrown out. I am not a stock boy. I am Oh, hello, Mr. Ono. I am busy right now. If you need something, why don't you talk to Emoli? She'll take care of you. Um, that's just crap here. Who would want that? What's that? Safety drill soon. Okay. Oh. There's nothing interesting here. This is like... This. I'm not even gonna bother robbing his food. That's that's just sad. What kind of backstore room is that? Where's the safe? That was just sad. If you don't see what you want, feel free to ask. Uh, yeah, I'm looking for a blonde, uh, age around 24. Oh, you're not carrying that kind of wear. Okay. Let's uh, sell Hi something. There. Hi there! Thanks for stopping in. Feel free to look around. I can take care of transactions, and if you've got questions, just ask. She looks a little bit like Moira from Fallout 3. Nice. What? What's a nice place like you doing in a girl like this? Wait, what? Thanks. It's hard work, but it all pays off in the end. Also, almost like an and Adidas tracksuit. <laughs> Gerhardt, my business partner, he does so much of the work behind the scenes. If it weren't for him, I don't know where we'd be now. Oh, please, take a look. Let's see what she sells. Ace Sidearm. 
That's a nice looking pistol. Laser sight, reflex sight, muzzle brake, armor piercing rounds. And high powered. Okay. Also costs 10,000 to buy. Ammo. We can buy ammo from her. Nice. Mm hmm. Oh, there's also 762. That's rifle rounds, probably. It's lasers. That's shotgun shells. There's also 11mm case less. That's also laser. 1.5 kilovolts, this is 3 kilovolts. 50 mi, what the hell? Is that maybe minigun ammo or something? And then 27 caliber, that is uh, probably ammo for the Magnum. Spacesuits, anything good? No, they don't really do anything, so that's. that's okay, let's see. Demos pack. Ground crew pack. It's just adding resistances and no no booster. I would like to have a backpack. <laughs> One that gives me more carry capacity, how about that? Yeah, space trucker stay space trucker space helmet, that's what I need in my life. Apparel. Hmm. Space trucker flannel. Oh god. Oh god. Alright. Um they have resources as well. Got a lot of resources. What what would be nice to see is if we had those resources, right? Like I would love to see if I have these resources. But we only see how many they have. You don't see how many you have in your inventory. That's not very helpful. They're selling digipix. I'm buying those. I'm buying all the digipix. And notes. Bad people, bad jokes. David Copperfield. Red Rover come over and the War of the Worlds. Nope. I can probably sell those, right? Yeah. Go away. Dover Beach. Great expectations. Grant issue. What happens if I sell that? Is my bonus gone then? I wonder. I have those quests already, right? So I can sell those mineral surveys. Hound of Monte Cristo. Nice. Well, I'm gonna keep those mines, I guess. Sell that. One helmet, one pack, one spacesuit. Not too many weapons. Um, oh, it's 43 Ultra Mac, different ca caliber. Okay. Sh sell from ship inventory. Here we go. That's the combat knife. There are the space suits that I wanted to sell. These guys have a little bit of money, so we're making a little bit of money here. Pirate raiding pack. Goodbye. Sell those helmets. Yes! Sell all those jumpsuits. Especially the bad ones. I mean, they're all bad. Ship parts. Repairs 4% ship help. Okay, that's <laughs> ship petty packs. Okay. And then my resources. Mis oh, the miscellaneous stuff. This is actually what I wanted to sell. The Eggmunds. Yes. But buy? I don't want to buy them. I want to sell them. Huh? It's selling it, right? Yes. In the Solar Frontiers game. I am selling everything, do die, do die, I am selling everything, oh do die day. The stuff is gonna go, la di da di da. We're making like tiny bits of credits from all this stuff, it's, it was not worth carrying this stuff around, 100% not worth. But, it's all gone now. It's all gone now. Appreciate the business. <sighs> I feel I feel relieved. Also, um, why do you have reflective surfaces? Uh oh, guys, guys, 
She's a vampire. She's a vampire. She's not reflecting. Oh shit, I'm also a vampire! Then we're all vampires. This is the space vampires. Um, yeah, the thing is, they don't have ray tracing in this game yet. Or I don't know if they'll have it, but they don't have ray tracing. And uh, yeah, as you can see, it's not reflecting very well. It's just. I don't know. There's a bit more in the back. I've, I've, it, they should have DLSS 3 and they should have ray tracing in that. It's got a little bit sad. And the thing is, AMD already said that they're, they're not preventing them from doing so. They can add it anytime they want. Okay, what's that? Where uh, does this go? Choose floor. Water permit on the. Okay, maybe not. Where are we even going? We're going this way. Terra Brew Coffee. This is like the space Starbucks with the racing seats. Tap to start. I'm gonna get myself an insane cup of coffee. I'm gonna go with a Terra Brook cappuccino. That's it. Welcome to Terra Brew. How could certainly please take your time? I'm over here. I all do the same basically. But hey, those coffees actually help with O2 recovery quite a bit. Interesting. So the food actually has value outside of that. Hmm. And um, what quest am I on, by the way? We are still in one small step. Okay. Did you say my partner and I? Started shopping for a crib. I know I sound like a commercial right now, but I've been to other stores and they My partner the and I were expecting. Mm. Oh yeah. It's not my wife or my girlfriend, no, no, my partner. I'm so They're probably vat growing the child or something. Okay. Hey, it's an information board. Welcome to New Atlantis. Lots of text. Capital of the United Colonies. Established in 2159. Mm -hmm. Earth was rendered uninhabitable in the year 2203. Okay. Corporate directory. Centurion Arsenal in the residential area. Also enhance. Alright, oh, there's more corporates. Outland, Jake's, and Apex Electronics. Okay. Other buildings and services. Sanctum Universum Church, House of Enlightenment. Okay, there's apparently a lot of things to do here. Citizenship. Service guarantees citizenship, let me guess. One time credit disimbursement. Oh. Access to home ownership in New Atlantis. What do you have to do? Ah, yeah. Service guarantees citizenship, I told you. Simplest way to achieve citizenship is a complete, complete tour of duty on in the Vanguard, the United Colonies' very own volunteer fleet. Yep. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna sign up. I'm gonna sign up. I'm gonna do my part. Most illegal underground ever. <laughs> Mass district. Here we go. I feel if you like exploring every single nook and cranny, you can you can sink hundreds of hours in this. I'm kind of missing the posters of the naked ladies. I'm I'm, I'm missing my cyberpunk posters. <laughs> oh sorry, cyberdong of course. You can just jump over people and don't even say anything. 
Hello? Watch this. 360! Whee! She's impressed. What's the word for that again? Uh, it's on the tip of my tongue. It's 360 no scope. 360 no scope, like I said. Uh, what? Not only are we all vampires, now we're also magicians. Okay. Alright. The water is quite aesthetically pleasing. Or so Barrett has told me. New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. We just need to convince her that Let's see what these flags are. Not really red. Ah, yes! Almost space Germany, but if the wrong way around. Okay. Glad we came here. Um, where am I even going? Oh, over there. Yes, survey stuff here. Flora, fauna, and resources, but probably not in here. <laughs> What's that? The lodge. We may be in a United Colonies city, but Constellation is an entirely neutral entity and always has been. should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. I have messaged the other members of Constellation. They will be waiting for us inside. Oh yeah, let's hold up the magic watch to open the door. I know, the older I get, the much easier I find things like that. Lodge of Sorceresses. Or also known as the country of Milfgard. The library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now. And he hopes you'll make this place your home. Okay, this is nice. United States. Look at the detail. This is nice. Like they went all out on some of the details on this stuff. Unlock. Nope. Requires a key. Ah yes, bus saw Aldrin. Requires a key, requires a key. Oh, hey! Yeah, this is either Compass, Rose, or NATO. <laughs> Alright, what's that? An alien tick. This, that's an a what? That's an alien tick. I don't want alien ticks, that's disgusting. Alright, open the door. Hello? How's it going? We appear to have a visitor. Welcome to Constellation. We have a lot to talk about. Would you care to tell us what happened to our friend? Why you're here and he isn't? I killed him and ate him. And then I made a necklace from his teeth. No? Okay. Um, who are you? Sarah Morgan, chair of Constellation. I don't see a chair. That means anything you discussed with Barrett is my business. Now, if you would please answer my question. Why don't we stop with you telling me what constellation is? Hmm. Very well. You first. This is a private organization dedicated to exploration. Space primarily, but also anomalies throughout the settled systems. It's inherently dangerous work, so if one of our own doesn't show up as planned, then we tend to have questions. Speaking of which, where is Barrett? Where is Arvident? Sorry. 
Couldn't help myself. Pirates attacked, and he asked me to deliver the artifact. I see. Vasco, verify. All statements made have been factual. Ugh. This is just typical. Barrett hands over our ship and our robot to some random employee of that discount mining outfit he uses. You want to go five rounds? Uh, and if we hadn't insisted on installing those emergency protocols, I guarantee you this rock breaker here would be halfway to Neo. I'm going to need one round. But that didn't happen. He's here with the artifact. What the hell is Thank that? Thank you, Mateo. Now, it looks like a holy man. what's in front of us, shall Feature we? Dude. What happened when it was extracted? Did anyone see anything? Hear anything? I don't know, but I went on a trip to space. How many times has this happened? Who else had these visions? We think it's anyone else who pulls one out of the rock for the first time. Why? We're not sure yet. So if you wouldn't mind adding another data point. Bright lights and music. Interesting. Similar to Barrett's description of the experience, with less embellishment. Are you hearing this? Do you all believe me now? Whether it happened or not wasn't in doubt. Ooh, more pieces. If you expect us to believe in fairy If this is the greatest mystery in the universe, why couldn't it be part of the ultimate mystery? But gentlemen, can we please focus? Noel, I think it's time we tested your theory. Right. Let's see. We know the artifacts react to each other. The pieces we already have move when they're in close contact. Now, if we add this new one to the two we already have... The artifact. If you could place it on the table here. Nope. Goodbye. You could actually just leave. <laughs> Can you imagine? That's how the story ends. A screen. Okay, it's a crappy screen, but it's a screen. It's got like a space probe on it with reflector panels. Like, I really like the style they went for. Especially all the technological stuff just looks spot on. Like, the artists and the, the, both the like the, the people that were going for the textures as well as the 3D artists did an amazing job. Like, this looks the most, I would say, real I've seen out of a game in ages. That's a cute little helicopter. Ah, yes, the HMS potato. Fine, sugar. Antique submarine clock. What? Damn it, they took it out of this boat. And the Mercury camera. That's some antiques here. We can't go up here yet. There's a violin here. And some books. Hard times, a Christmas carol. I could steal the books and sell them. There's a wooden duck here. Hmm. Well, now we're officially in space, Skyrim. This is warm. This is nice. All right. All right. Let's move on. Bonk. Just like the others. It just goes like foot. We thought there were only two of them at first. That looks like a lot more. Uh oh. Oh my God. That's it. They're reacting. Look at how it's coming together. That energy that's arcing between them, no manufactured material in the settled systems can do that. None of them. This proof. Easy, girl. Breathe. You'll have a heart attack. She's not the only one. If they're coming together, that means there's a set. Built by an intelligence outside the settled systems. Still 2,000 credits for our little wager, Scott, right? You're on, Walter. Well, if we had all the answers, it wouldn't be exciting, now would it? Not to take away from the moment, but what are we going to do about our new friend, 
Pay me. <laughs> so, are you ready to get to work? See if exploration is the life you want to lead in this little universe of ours? I would take her as a co-pilot. How much do you know about these artifacts? Individually, they're just odd hunks of metal. Another oddity from the uncharted reaches of space. As to what they are, what they're building. Well, you'll be part of solving that puzzle now. You want me in Constellation? What does that mean? Is this like a cult or something? We're all here because we're committed to exploring space. Humanity may have settled the stars, but that doesn't mean we should stop diving into the unknown. Beyond that, you'll be expected to use your own judgment, just like the rest of us. So basically it's like a loosey-goosey Starfleet. Boldly go where no one has gone before. I'm in. You should take some time to get settled in. Introduce yourself to everyone. Some of our members aren't here, but you'll meet them soon. Come find me when you're ready. You and I are going to be doing some traveling together. Oh, yeah. Get your feet She's wet. into me. And here. I think you've earned something for bringing the artifact to us. Money. In addition to credits, why don't we set you up with a backpack with some boost capability? Hmm? You'll need it out in the field anyway. Just mind your head. Yeah, if you've seen the YouTube short I posted, you know what I'm talking about. Mind your head. Jetpacks indoors. Also, I've got a song in my head now. Power boost. <laughs> Alright. Talk to Noelle about quarters. Who's Noelle? Hope you've got your pen at the ready, Walter. Bills That's Sarah. It's been quiet That's Noelle. around here ever since Vladimir went to live on the Eiffel time. Oh, I'm taking, talking to Noelle about quarters. What else? Done quests or that's done. Yeah. Oh here. Yeah. Okay, let's this do that then. Requires funding, I'm afraid, and we're making good progress these that days. That was intense, wasn't it? The artifacts, I mean. Sorry, this must all be a little overwhelming for you right now. Nope. We're I good. guess a lot overwhelming now that I think about it. I'm Noel. It's really nice to meet you. And thank you for bringing the artifact to us. Uh, how long have you been working on all this? Well, Constellation's been around forever, more than 50 years now. But we only became aware of the artifacts recently. Barrett discovered the first one about two years ago, right under our noses. And he was the one who got this all in motion. It's a shame he isn't here to see this. What do you think my vision was? Oh, right, that. If we were approaching this rationally, I suppose we'd call them visual and auditory hallucinations. What you perceived as lights and music could be overloaded neural input, your brain's attempt to make sense of something, an energy surge, some other phenomenon. I saw a space map. Uh, Barrett saw something too. He did. At the time, well, it's Barrett. We weren't sure if he was kidding around. Clearly, he wasn't. That wasn't random snaps is fine. That means something. Sure, I'm not trying to suggest otherwise. I wasn't there when it happened. I'm just thinking it through. That's okay. Now that this has happened to both you and Barrett, we can know to maybe expect it in the future. Be a little more prepared. We're all in this together now, right? Hmm. Other types of exploration work besides the artifacts? Of course. There's plenty of planets out there that no one has ever set foot on, and everything we learn about them is valuable. We have a board where we post anything specific of course, we're looking got a board. for. A type of alien flora or fauna, or a planet with a specific quality, like if it's primed to have life but doesn't yet. Nice. You seem to know a little bit about these artifacts. Oh hmm? gosh, no. I mean, that's that's flattering, but really, we're making this up as we go. Oh dear. Until you arrived, we only had the two, and the vaguest sense that there was something more. Or upset work. the entire space-time continuum. So much we don't know, and that means a lot of work ahead of us. 
So what about... Let me know if I can help you learn more. Well, right now, nothing's off the table. Metallurgical analysis, chemical composition. I'm looking at everything. One thing I'm really trying to improve is my overall database of xenobiology. I don't know if it will help in this case, but the more we know about, well, everything, the better off we are, right? Speaking of, if you're going to be out there looking for more artifacts, you're bound to come across some interesting specimens. Anything organic, I'd be happy to take it off okay. your hands. Organic stuff. How would that help you? I can't be certain that they will, but more data points are always a good thing. I don't want to rule out anything that could provide a breakthrough. And if it sweetens the deal, I can pay. Pretty well, too. Walter's pockets may not be bottomless, but they are pretty deep. Got some organic resources for you. Great, let's see what you have. Um. So from our ship. Oh, that stuff she buys. I thought this would be like special stuff that she pays special for, but this doesn't look very special. Never mind them. So there's something about a, a place for me to stay. Planning on sticking around them? Good. I think we can find a spot for you. And along the way, I can give you the very abbreviated tour. Sounds good. Right, true. So you've I seen the library, long, obviously. Duh. Quite proud of the collection, but Matteo has made more than a few contributions. Gardens are out the doors there. If you need a moment of quiet contemplation, emphasis on the quiet part. At least usually. Okay, so heavy metal gardens over here. Sebastian Banks, Constellation's founder, had this place built decades ago. It was a big to do at the time, but most people in the city have forgotten we're here. Those animations look a little bit weird. Like she's almost like jitter gliding when she's putting her feet down. But I mean, it's Bethesda, so you know what you get. So apparently, she's got a key. There's a room. There's a room. Oh, that's a cool pathway. Hello. I'm gonna loot everything here. That's the bar. Caution red floor. Now what? So this is the bar. Usually no tender, so help yourself within reason, of course. Now let's see about that room. You're in luck. We were almost at max occupancy already, but there's still one room up for grabs. It's been nice having the place open. Mm -hmm. She says help ourselves, right? Dracula! Jonathan Harker's journal. The Origin of Species. That's Charles Darwin. Moby Dick. Call me Ishmael. I regret. We all got great expectations. What? Sir Livingston's journal. Okay. What else? Fancy ice bucket. Cocktail tumblers. Where's the stuff? Where's the booze? There's no booze here. What do you mean with help yourself? There's nothing to help myself with! I mean, the stuff on tap, maybe? Everybody's just got air de broy. Weird place. Alright, moving on. Where did she go? It was fast. What's this? Oh! Found the broom closet. Yo, um, no, would you would you like to show me the broom closet maybe? No? Sad face. What's this? Conference room. The display projector. Alright. Okay, this'll be you. Common room on one side, so that'll be quiet, and Mateo on the other side, so maybe a little less quiet. I'm sure Sarah has something planned for each of us, so I'd better get back to it. Don't want to keep her waiting too long. That's my room. Enjoy. Thank you. What kind of sailing ship is that? It's got slots for cannons, though. Then we've got this thing. This is one thick ship. I like it. 
That's a warship. UC sec. Nice. That's Mateo's room, right? Or is that my room? Nope, this is Mateo's room apparently. It's an owned bed. It's got an incense burner. Notepads. Hmm. Okay. This is my room, right? Let's see. Will be dick. No, it belongs to me. Exotic bottle. Yep, I'm taking that. Nicholas Nickleby. Yep. Sealed cocktail mixer. Chandra Chardonnay for more persuasion. There's a storage safe right here. Okay. Chronomark watch case. Ah, this is the thing they have in the collector's edition. Yeah, yeah. Yoink. There's a bed. Okay, what else do we have here? I'm checking all of this out. So, Livingston's second journal. Visit the Apollo landmark on Luna. Ooh, that could be good. Rum, thank you for the nine months. A lamp planter. Oh, I just oh, oh I threw over the plant. I'm sorry, whoever's whoever's room that is, with the meditation mat and everything. I apologize for doing things. I'm getting lost in here. Let's keep exploring. Ah, another broom closet. Let's see. Nope, there's nothing good here. Why, is that, why isn't there more stuff to steal? Oh! Alright! Yeah, we got a workout. No, this is not the workout room, this is somebody's personal room. Drink pack vodka! Plus 8 carry capacity for 5 minutes. Yep. Now we know. Return of the Interceptor coming this fall. Feeding the front lines. Okay. Toy spaceship. Kinda cute. This side up. Do not open without authorization. Well, there's nothing to open, unfortunately. Instant oatmeal and oat clusters. And a plush, plushy Xeno snuggle. <laughs> Alright. That's a big set of rooms. Oh, what does this lead to? Okay, somebody very techy is working here. Many gel. All right, we'll take that. Desktop fishbowl. Okay. Cosmetics supply box. Okay, a lady lives here. Probably Noel. This will probably be Noel, right? That's probably her. Most likely. Lots of techy stuff. Thank you. I'm getting lost here. Ah, this is a bathroom. The communal shitter. Walter Stroud. Tell me I assist you. Uh, no, I don't need anything. Just uh checking in. Hourglass. How you're doing. At present, Funky Sphere sculpture. Well oh, parameters. money. Right. I'll take that, thank you very much. Report on constellation. Although Constellation's relevance has been a subject of much debate, the disappearance of founder Sebastian Blake was a blow most felt the organization couldn't survive. In fact, Constellation's disbanding seemed Im imminent until Chloe Bao changed her vote in the 11th hour, thus ensuring the group's continued operation, at least for a time being. And she became chair. Became chair, okay. Um, that's a big globe. Point to where TTB lives on this map. Spy glasses. Aja Mamas Mamas's diary. Potential new members. Ah, so you see was bringing in more people. Russell Luther is from the Freestock Collective Military.
Evan Madani is a biologist. Bad is a physicist, actually. Is Lo Chen, philosopher. Jin Tao Min. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, geode sculpture. This looks. This looks nice. I want that. He strikes again. I think we've seen everything in here. This door. Oh, I have the lodge key. And this goes to New Atlantis. Uh, oops, I just went outside. Yes, guys, DLSS mod works. If you go to Nexus mods for this game, you will find several versions. I can post you the link, of course. Okay, this is just to go outside and sit around here. Or to boost to the roof. Can I boost to the roof of this thing? Okay. Um, apparently this is the garden then, right? What do I gain from being up here, though? Nothing, right? It's kind of pointless. Let's get back in. <laughs> Unfortunately, nothing hidden up here. Hmm. Alright, what else do we have to do? We talked to that. Check out the Constellation Mission Board. Where's the Constellation Mission Board? Over there? How do we get there? Into the basement? Alright! Medipack. Is that a, what is this, the kitchen? Desktop speakers? Metabolic agent, we'll take that. Ammo case? What was that ammo case? Here. Yep. Yep, 43 altar mag, yep. Good. Adapt the frame. Save a wire. This is the crafting station area, basically. Um, I'm still looking for the board, right? Oh, that's the mission board, okay. Let's see what kind of missions are available. Oof, a lot of them. Area from life in Indium. Sure. Mission to locate a planet trait is the most challenging survey mission. You will need to search the entire solar system for a planet that has a target trait. Locate planets and target system have traits. Unsurveyed planets will have unknown traits. Okay, this is gonna be oof, okay. Locate energetic rifting in Alpha Turner. Yes. Locate pelted fields in Sirius. Sonora's Lithosphere in Olympus and light Survey Lightens Rock and Lightens Star. Okay. That's a planetary survey progress uh, task. Okay. Alright, I accepted all the missions because why the hell not? Um, hello. Muzzle and me. Okay. Hey, there's more. Did you pick? Is there anything else that we can loot? That's good. What else do I want? A hypno art lamp? No. Shadow crackers. Two dates for Darla. Well, at least I got the poster. Very nice and diverse. Forever human. Is that a candle? No. That is a toilet. Complete with toilet paper, no less. What? Hello? Needs a master key to open that. Okay. Well, if I get a master key at some point, I'm coming here and taking that, that's for sure. What else do we have down here? Nothing. The well. Oh no, I just went outside. Ah! I went outside. Uh, what is this? Hello. What's going on down here? Why is it so disgusting?
I'm doing side trip to get that man out. Wait, what? Chunks special sauce. Uh, oh, they're, they're cutting up fish in here, okay. Alright, I was thinking for a second. Oh, that's a lot of blood. Door locked. Requires key. Okay. Maybe we won't be going there. Let's go back. Did I choose the background of the luxurious home? No, I did not. I didn't want to pay an insane amount of credits every week. Back to the lodge. Let's uh, actually continue the story a little bit. High pressure canister. Okay. Back up. Oh, let's go to New Atlantis. Oof. Oh, because they want me to send me on quests. No, 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 no. We need to go to. Um, uh, the old neighborhood. Talk to Sarah. Got my first mission. At your service, Captain. Hi, Sarah. Hey, as much Sarah. As I love uncovering new questions. I wouldn't mind a few answers now and then. I don't know. I, I would say Mass Effect did the buttocks better. Like this is clearly no ass effect. That's for sure. You've got something for me. So, are you ready to get to work? Or was there something else? Can you please turn around? This is creeping me out. Talk to you later. Ready to get out there? I'm ready. We're going to be doing some old-fashioned detective work. Yay! The artifacts are relatively inert once they're out of bedrock. That means people can pass them around not even knowing what they are. I've been letting my contacts know to be on the lookout for strange metal objects. Get back a lot of noise, usually. But a tip from the UC Vanguard sounds promising. The UC Vanguard? A volunteer force that helps defend the edges of United ah, Colonies space. That, but I, the thing They're I wanted to join. always looking for recruits. Yep. Lots of retired veterans and dangerous professionals mixed in with part-timers who barely have a laser cannon welded to a hull. Mm -hmm. My contact is in the recruiting office, so he hears a lot about what the volunteers are up to. Mm -hmm. Yep. Jumping to anthropology on me already. Oh, well, good. We all need our own reasons to be out there. But it's not just that. I want to take this opportunity to see how you handle yourself and for you to learn more about us. I'm going to be sticking with you for this. We'll be traveling together until we either find an artifact or this lead runs dry. We'll be traveling buddies. But you get off all of this anyway, this constellation of a salary. <laughs> you mean besides the ship, the robot, and a place to stay all rent free? Yes. We do have some funds we can disperse from time to time. Not to mention, I think we can get you a proper suit. Yes. We're explorers. We keep a lot of equipment on hand for that purpose. So the more you work with us, the more we can share what we have. So we'll be lucky to follow if you continue. All right. You and me until we get that artifact. We'll need to head to Mast. Check in with the Vanguard recruiting office where my contact works. And listen, whatever you were before or whatever you do once you're out there, I don't care. So long as you don't bring UC security to our doorstep. Every member of don't Constellation gotcha. has their own conscience. Understood? <laughs> do you mean you don't care if I steal so I don't get caught? <laughs> Understood. Good. Let's take a little stroll through New Atlantis, shall we? That sounds good. Take a little stroll through the city, but we'll do that in the next episode. Thank you so much, supporters. Couldn't do it without you. If you want to join Team TTB, check out the Join button right here on YouTube. Super thanks button in the comment section, or of course the links to Patreon or the merch store listed in the video description.